Tokyo Revengers, episode 10. We're back, finally. Our timing on that was, like, perfect. Oh, would you press it? Literally, as I pressed it, it, and it changed, you started. And look, man, just, we just moved with the We're phone. finally about to see. Hey, oh, no, shit. I forgot Damn. this shit was right here. <laughs> Yo, that's about to hurt my ears. Um, it hurt your ears. It's going to hurt theirs. We, we finally about to see what happened, because I hope he's not dead. Yeah, same. Um, personally, I don't think it's going to be, you know, cause it, unless he finds some way to go back in time even further again, because once it was done, it was done, you know, he yeah. couldn't go back in time a second time. That is one of the or things I he like takes him this. to the hospital in time. Look, he was, them, them eyes were out of it, though. That's the part that kind of scares me a little bit. He, he got stabbed, and he wasn't Oh, uh, driving on the ground in pain. Look, I'm about to tell you, this is how it's actually going. about to go. Because how the time and space and the stars align, he's going to be alive. So in other alive. words, because it's a fucking anime. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, fuck it. Let's watch it and find out. I can't believe we actually waited a week because I thought we were going to record the episode ahead of time, but apparently not. You guys listen to Phil Collins? What the fuck? You, you been smoking, boy? I don't smoke. That's the sad part. I forgot they started doing long ass recaps for this show. Oh yeah. Cause this is this is this is the beginning of the previous episode. Can I get a haul, yeah? <laughs> no. Not in the way you just yelling that shit. I don't ever, ever wanna ever wanna hear you say that shit. <laughs> you ain't gotta worry about that, trust me. And it hit hit my man's in the head with a fucking bat. The thing is how you want if you gonna jump somebody, don't get fucked up. That too. It's actually really sad. Like I said, y'all a bunch of like 13, 14, maybe even 15 year olds, and y'all talking about killing people. So they, do they just hang their uh, their gang uniforms up in their closet when they go home? Dressed in the regular clothes? Because it's wild as fuck that when is. you think about it. Oh yeah, and this dude oh, yeah. seemed like he was already a fucking problem. And he told the shit. Look how long his neck is. Mikey was pretty much unstoppable all around. Like he just went like, block. Yeah, block. I'm like, it seems like a lot of the gang leaders, though, are like freaks of nature themselves. As though. they should be. You're a leader for a reason. Yeah. And then the homies came up. He showed up with the squad. <laughs> Wait, I forgot that smiling kid. <laughs> Luck. <laughs> just punch him in the fucking head, yelling die the entire time. How tall do you think he is? Like 6'5"? He's, he's got it. Well, they're all middle school, so... He's probably like 6'2". Yeah, he looks like he's about Draken's height. And I'd assume Draken was like 6'6", six 6'1". Six <laughs> God damn. You know you gotta have the white shoes on, though. Oh, yeah. I remember that. And if Draken were to actually die here, man, he better watch his back, because he's starting this shit. He did it. He finally did it. He's, that's what he's about to say. Watch. Oh, fucking psychic over here. See, I, you ain't I, seen I can, last episode. I, I, I see you to the future. I definitely got to hurry the uh, YouTube uploads up for this show. By far. Oh yeah, hard knocks. Yeah. Damn, had they actually had cell phones? Wait, they had cell phones, right? Yeah, the she had a phone. fucking cell phone with it. She could have, you know, helped. It's two thousand six, not nineteen eighty two. Yeah, true. Though I don't know what kind of technology y'all had back then. Go around here to see this. Honestly, with how the gangs are in this area, that's true. A bunch of fucking psychopaths. Honestly, I I just mind my business. It's like keep your head down, nobody, roll them up. Doing, yeah, basically, <laughs> roll them up. When's the last time you've been in one of those cars where it had the, like the the rolling? Chip? Yeah. Remember the the green car we had? Damn. That was a uh, one of those roll them up type cars. You know, that all the older um, than me. All the U-Haul trucks still got that shit. Why? You all, they ain't worrying about technology. They it's worry like, about look, you gonna you gonna move your shit or not? That you gonna talk about how advanced our stuff <laughs> Basically. is? Basically, get out of here with that. All so right, you ordered a can... big box truck, nigga, not a fucking supercar. Yeah, you can go move all your stuff. This ain't no advanced Uber motherfucker. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you have another truck, an advanced <laughs> truck to move your stuff? Cause you wouldn't be calling us. When was lie. the last time you guys ever been in a car that had the little roll-up windows? Close. 
some of them, you know, as well, some people might have never even been in it, depending on the age of the, the people watching That this. or somebody's about to get hella offended that we just made fun of their U-Haul truck. Because let's be honest, most of our viewers watching this are on YouTube. Our patrons don't even really seem to really fuck with this right now. Right now. Damn. They might be waiting for us to finish or, or get high enough in it. But. Screw you, then. That's how y'all want to be. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're cool people. But um, this this will be the first time they actually go to watch it. Everybody watches it. <laughs> fuck you, Justin. They're like, yo, I fucking hate that guy. <laughs> um, my name is Zach3276. But, uh... Yeah, you know, it's probably just been a while for most people. Some people, now that this, like I said on YouTube, 13 to 20 years old, probably never. Damn. Shit, when they were born, cars were 2006 and up. Shit, this was going on when they were born, technically. Come on, cough. Get up, cough. Good! Yes. Good! Never thought I, I'd be so happy to hear somebody cough blood. Right? Damn! Damn, yo, he's getting his ass beat. Pick his ass up and take him to the nearest hospital or something. Call nine. Don't sit there like a, a character. You have a cell phone. I know you got some type of ambulance. Look at that guy in the background doing. He's just going wham, boom. No, you hit me. Jack can seem like that person's gonna be entirely grateful to him too for saving him. Come on, <laughs> still fucking smiling. Save him. And I mean, when you think about it too, it makes a lot of sense. Well, obviously pick him up because he's dying. But you gotta think if he wasn't there last time when this happened, he just flat out just died. Nobody yeah. even noticed until after the battle was over, most likely. Because he's there, this could be. I feel like they, if what's going to make this get even worse is the fact that he got stabbed. So they're going to come after the oh, nigga that stabbed him. Is it Pa? Because yeah, because from that point, it's also probably going to be a lot more violent too. Mm -hmm. It's not going to be just like street fighting or anything. Go! Don't stop. I think you better learn how to run. Shit, that'd have been a wake up call for me. Just when we thought it wasn't, the camera overheated. Glad they were there. Oh yeah, because that, that also would probably change it too, because they called the ambulance. Yeah. Don't cry. It's okay. Don't die. Man, if she was there the first time, I feel bad for her. Come on, survive this. And run. Nigga, they're trying to kill you. Go Super again, Saiyan. If he dies, go Super Saiyan. They did attack those other girls before. Yeah. Uh, Mobius, so wouldn't put a pass in there. He's tired of running. Bro, would you ever be able to live something like that down? No. Honestly? Get stronger. And on top of that, if you let this go like it is, they're going to try to push you in front of a chain and kill you. So yeah, somebody out there is. <laughs> yeah, because I'm, I'm willing to bet they don't try that just once. Harness the power of main character plot. Come on, do some do, do some shit. I don't even know what to do at this point. Show some powers or something. You travel back in time <laughs> so you might get have... fucked up. <laughs> Tell them to run. Listen, they may be women, and I get that they, that dude's like six foot, but I'm like, there's plenty of women that are strong enough, especially with adrenaline, to pick somebody so, up and run. Shit, you exactly. pick him up and go. She even if it takes both of y'all. Of course, there's no diss to women strength-wise. That's, that's not where I was going with that. You know, his shirt's ironic. No, it's not, actually. He's trying to get that. It is only because I said so. And <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Come on, do something. 
before he gets a punch, somebody's gonna stop him and be able to save him. Somebody's gonna hopefully the cops come if he gets fucked up. Yo, thumbnail. thumbnail! I was just getting ready to say. It's also another sync point, just in case you lose anything in there. You, you know exactly which part we were talking about. Oh yeah, they did, did. have to fight. Oh yeah, he was also doing fine. <laughs> Yo, just kick him in the balls and run. <laughs> this is stupid as shit, but fuck it, why not? <laughs> you see what the power of like friendship and stuff does? They would just jump him anyway, even if he did start losing. But this is the same dude that was like, get my, uh, remember he was like, get my knife or whatever it was. Yeah, it was like a straight bitch. Basically. Yo, beat his ass. Fucking finally, because he needs to. Is that the one that stabbed him? That is, right? Yeah. Wait. No, no. No, was, he's not. He's that yeah. just nigga that's just mad that he got his shit fucked up in front yeah. of everybody. Dodge. I don't think it's going to be that easy. Straight bitch! Oh my god! Take the knife right out your hand, stab that nigga. Bro, the fucking sound! No, he's a whim. Dude's a whole bitch. <laughs> he pulled out a knife like, nigga, we ain't fighting out here. <laughs> Fuck you thought this was? The screets. <laughs> like he said, this ain't no one on one. Nah, the dude is a bitch though. Straight bitch. There was no reason why he couldn't have uh, fought him hand to hand right there. But then again, if he was gonna do that, he'd have tried it with Draken. Somebody come in to save the day. Why would you throw that? I mean, I get, you know, he probably doesn't want to use a weapon, but I'm like, look, man, it's seven, seven people. Fuck, if you can save a lot, a little bit of jail time might not be too bad. He's got a oh. flashback. He get the power of flashback on this side right now. Shit, not very far with those fists. That, the amount of people that uh, are going to die if he fails. You got to think. They're going to try to kill him. Somebody doesn't just push somebody in front of he a train. He ends up committing suicide. They save themselves and they're just like, well, damn, all right. It didn't work. Let's not kill him. They're going to try to kill him. Dude, it's gonna be even worse now suicide. because of this shit that's happening. Mm -hmm. Is that his last name? Yeah, I'm assuming. Never really paid attention to his name too much because he didn't really say his last name a lot. Camera stopped like literally like seven times in a row. We've been having trouble with like overheating pretty heavily. Hopefully, that's the last one. They always tackle him. Once again, should have probably should have picked up that knife, honestly. Self defense at this point. I don't know Japanese laws. <laughs> Bite his bitch ass. Exactly. Go Goku with it. I know you're not talking. Bro, his ribs are done. Guaranteed. Rip the skin off of him if you oh, have Oh shit. To. Oh shit. Yo. Come on. Yo, he got it like that. Yo. <laughs> all right. All right. Yo. Choke his ass out. This thing got moving? Ain't no tapping out in this case either. Yo, he's fast. Right? That's what he probably should have been using the whole time instead of trying to use strength. Because clearly he couldn't keep up with him. I feel like... Choke him out. Choke him out. Come on. Come on. I'm surprised he can fucking scream. He's <laughs> still bleeding out like that. Guaranteed. 
Come on. Ambulance shows up as soon as he chokes him out. He it got to. Kill him. And you got fucked up. No, no, no. Let, let's chill out. You don't, <laughs> you don't want murder charges. On his knees. On you. Close enough. Somebody get this nigga off me. He probably should stop choking him out. Otherwise, he really will kill him. Talk to you got a body. <laughs> you gotta put the teardrop on. You gotta get the teardrop. So much fucking blood, too. You know, when you think about a 12 year old him is gonna wake up like, what the fuck did I do? Get your girl. It's all for you. <laughs> Quite literally, actually. <laughs> she don't realize her life on the line. This man's time. literally saving everyone else's lives just for her. Well, like I said, it's also to figure out who tried to kill him, too. So. That, too. But yeah, you're right. Don't ask me no shit like that after somebody just... It's like, yo, I'm the one dying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're gonna be like best friends for life. Along with him and Mikey. Yo, come on. That yo, that man's guy. ears are massive. Now that's pot calling the kettle black. The adrenaline. Come on. That man was literally holding on for dear life. Called the ambulance for Draken, but uh. Looks like both of them are gonna need it. Yo, everybody else gotta show up behind them. That'd be Bro, amazing. this is the most amazing thing. Right? It's hot as shit in here. I know. No, don't say that yet. Another thumbnail. Fucks with the show so heavy. Yeah, oh, the shit. homies. The, the homies. last people that I was fucking expect. Damn. Oh, <laughs> shit. I thought that the fucking knife and... <laughs> oh, my God. You know I stabbed him in the face? Yeah, and I stabbed him in the neck. <laughs> I'm like, yo, you watching? Yo, time, suicidal. Don't say that. What the fuck is your problem? <laughs> yo, what the fuck? Well, at, oh, least got, at least it got rid of the Goku knife. stance. Right. <laughs> What's that, Vegeta? <laughs> it's one of them. Pretty sure it's Vegeta, actually. At least... Damn! All that shit just to get the ass beat. <laughs> Camera stopped for like the fifth time, but it's cool because at least it stayed on doing the good parts. At least it'll stall. And the knife's gone. I don't remember him asking for that. <laughs> Fuck. Come on, somebody get a punch in. Symbolism. His friends are changing steadily with him. There's hope for him after all. <laughs> Is this man actually shook? I thought he's about to get some power or some shit. <laughs> oh, thank you. Like, where the fuck was this this entire time? Probably happened in the case of like like 23 seconds because it's anime time. 
fucking hate this camera. I <laughs> know, right? Shit pisses me off. It fucks sorry, up the, the, the feeling of the last, like, ten seconds of the episode. That was a good episode, bye. That, like, nah. that shit was crazy, that's, I'm so glad that he, um... Stop this. Oh, uh, I'm so glad that he, the, he actually got a win for once. Bro, if he had caught a body, like I said earlier, he definitely got to get that teardrop tattoo on his face. <laughs> <laughs> like, yo, I caught a body. But, um... He he moved faster than I thought. So yeah. Yeah, look, I, it seems like as far as like him battling anybody else or fighting anybody else, he probably needed the entire time to uh, move around a bit more. But I mean, look, he's been scared. Even then, though, it, I, I can't, he's been getting fucked up. I'm proud to see that he actually did something more, and that his friends kind of came out of nowhere. Because I was wondering how this was going to go. I thought the ambulance was just going to come. Just as they were about to attack him with the knife, and they were gonna, you know, run, fuck, let's get out of here, you know, yeah. those moments. But that wasn't the case, you know. So I'm kind of wondering how this is gonna play out. I guess the rest of it, they'll just be like, oh yeah, the fight ended. Then they'll show them in the hospital or something next episode. Dragon has to this, has to survive this. That's gotta be ultimate respect for Taka. That's why I said he he's obviously got it's in uh, fucking survive this because all of this happened to relay the message, yo, new right hand man, yeah. new guy. Don't save him in the first place. Yeah. But from all the way to the beginning, if I'm liking everybody else, that's a whole new kind of respect, mm-hmm. you know, for the entire gang. Now they gotta put up their gang signs. <laughs> Not the Nazis. I'm simple. honestly surprised they had no. We, we don't we don't go spray paint that. Yeah. Even though I, I once again we get that that's not what that's supposed to be here. It's just that ain't still, it. Still, it's that's, that's still not it. I'm kind of surprised they don't have any gang signs they've been throwing up this entire time. But, do, uh, do they do that in Japan? I have no fucking clue. I don't know. I don't know shit about Japanese gangs, honestly. But uh, yeah, we want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check us out on Patreon for the full reaction. Um, we're gonna keep going and everything. And we're going to definitely be flurrying YouTube with a bunch of uploads and things, you know. So, yeah.